It is an individual that was deceased for nine days, unfounded, undiscovered, and literally melted through the floor. Do you ever wonder what happens when the police leave? Crime scene cleaners are private companies that handle the cleanup after the police are gone. Spalding Decon is one of the nation's largest cleanup companies handling the aftermath of homicides, suicides, decompositions, hoarding, and much more. These are our stories. Hey guys, welcome to our newest decomp. Uh, we've got a large, large job upstairs here, and it is an individual that was deceased for nine days, unfounded, undiscovered, and literally melted through the floor, coming through the gas pipe right here, leaking onto the uh, garage floor below. probably lifted up and he slipped <laughs> and then yeah he was he kept a medical journal uh with him and about 10 days ago his last comment was that he wasn't feeling well from that point forward uh by the looks of it he collapsed and when he collapsed he ended up hitting his head on a metal piece over here. Homeowner also recognized that blood had followed the course of the gas line and has leaked downstairs into the garage area. Uh, I said I'm down there. All right. Oh no, I didn't. So the plan, the plan with the bio here is, is for starters, we're going to take the rug out. Uh, from there, we're going to start taking the carpet out. Next will be the walls. We have to take up, uh, go up to 24 inches from the base. Make sure that all the walls are clean up to that point. From there, we're going to check the second uh, second layer underneath the carpet. There you go. Okay. Yeah, you did. Big old, okay. big old piece of flesh. Buffet. Yep. Right. Oh. I need another bag real quick. Okay. When I start, I don't stop. I'm going to name this one John. Uh oh, little, little Bill over here. Mm -hmm. So, as you can see all through here, right right about where the paint stops being blue, we have bio that comes all the way down this beam right here. And it all came from the gas line right here, which leads all the way upstairs. Oh my God, that was me. I'll admit what's wrong. Okay, will you be here? Just because the uh, because the bio dropped down into the floor and leaked down into the garage below, 
We have to get all this flooring up just to clear out any bio that's actually here. I need a, the milk crate of chemicals. Yeah. Okay, so it's just I'm right telling here. You, I couldn't find any. I see. I'll put that one. Yeah, I do. <laughs> so what? the decomposition here in the Tampa Bay area and uh, we're taking up the floor. This is great news because we thought that there was one piece of subfloor that was going to go all the way down to the first floor, but there's actually two. So because this is three quarters inch thick, we might be saved and not have to take that level down too. So this is good news for us. So uh, Kyle's doing a great job by pulling it. We've already turned off the gas line, so there's no worries there. Okay, so I'm gonna spray and see if anything went through that layer of subfloor. I'm almost positive that it did not, because when I lifted up the subfloor, I looked at the bottom, as you can see here, and there's nothing. Ah, right here. So. Not that spot, just that spot. Uh, yeah, I knew he went through. So what this is, is moisture. That's all it is. So we've got a puddle here that came from upstairs. I think it's bio. What do you 20 think? 20 bucks says it's bio. What do you think? I don't think it's bio. What do yeah. you think it is? I oil? think it's oil. Okay, so the chemical will tell us. Are we ready? Yes. Oh, if we're right, she buys one. Yeah. No. No, you're not. Wait a minute. Yeah, we you're are. You're not! Look. This part. Where? Right there. Oh, right there. All right, the results are we are both correct. There no. Are maggots <laughs> that are potentially coming from the ceiling and this could be oil it did indicate in some areas but not the entire thing like i said i was right the wood see it dark yeah see it's dark beam. down a little bit yeah no it's not see that's what i wanted to know have you ever wanted to know what it takes to become a crime scene cleaner well now you can this black friday we are going to gift one person a thousand dollars off of our full course package bundle in this course, we not only teach you the cleaning, but most importantly, the business side of this industry. Click the link in our bio to win $1,000 today. We will be announcing the winner on Black Friday. Right now, after we've cleaned all the bio, we decided to wipe down all the walls to make sure there's no you know, larva from flies or maggots or anything like that. And uh, we are going to tape up the area to let it dry from the chemicals that we just put it on, which would be cleaned it with um, simple green. And we also cleaned it with shockwave.
Um, wasabi peas um, from 6 29 of all the bio and took that out. Today we're going to throw away all the garbage because the family does not want it and neither does the tenant. After that we're going to remove the rugs and then we are going to kill it and clean up and then we are out of here. shockwave on this because I'm gonna have to scrub it by hand usually we use a scraper but it doesn't seem like it's coming up so I'm gonna go ahead and take this wire brush over here and I'm gonna scrub it by hand and see if I can get it up that way so we're gonna be cutting into the ceiling here just because we did have some bio uh, um, indicate when we were working earlier so we are gonna cut into the ceiling Oh yeah, that's indicating.
Hey guys, we are at the end of this uh, really big decomposition job. We uh, had to go from the top floor down to the bottom garage and go up. Uh, there was fluid that had leaked through the gas line. So we're finally finished now. Um, you know, we're relieved, but also nobody should die like that. So that's really super sad, but uh, there's absolutely no odor now. We've taken care of everything. So super pleased with the job. On to the next. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and ring that bell to be notified of the next episode. For more information, visit any of our locations.